Okay, it is uh, ending, starting towards the end of the month here. It is, well, it is October the 29th today, and uh, Preptober, Preptober, Preptober. I um, actually sat and, not sat, <laughs> stood at my desk and, and kind of um, tried to do more outlining. I feel like I've got a lot of the the very front part of the story, but I'm having trouble kind of hopping, hopping over into the, uh, into the second, I don't know if it's the second half or the, the last third of the, of the story, basically where I get, um, you know, it's the story, the story quick, 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 quick is, uh, Jesse, uh, young guy, finds a uh, device in the woods and he uh, he takes it to school and a kind of a geeky guy there helps him figure out that it's a wireless charge he charges it and is thrilled to find that he has his own electronic kind of what he thinks is a cell phone because his parents won't let him have a cell phone and it's um he's a fairly hapless dude to begin with but you know he's that much more isolated because he doesn't have any internet he doesn't have any phone uh any cell phone any smart devices uh he just kind of works on uh probably does some stuff on a, on a crappy computer at school but you know he types stuff up at home probably to hand into class because you know nobody's accepting handwritten stuff anymore or, you know, not for someone who, his age, which is like 13 or 14. Um, and uh, yes, he finds he's got this device. And, oh, it's got a game on it. And, uh, well, actually, first he finds that the device seems to just be gibberish. And he's kind of disappointed. He takes it home, goes to sleep. Um, at which point, he wakes up at the, uh, the next day. And he feels like he's got like a sting on the back of his head. Uh, and he can suddenly read the device and when he takes it to school to show it to Bert um his friend his sort of friend his geek the tech support uh is like no this is just still squiggles so the thing has reprogrammed his head um is the idea and so but you know it's like okay but then he finds that there's like hey there's a princess in this in this game in here and he gets really obsessed with the game and there's a manual too and it's like oh it's kind of a cool manual it's like kind of for doing stuff like levitating and 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 moving things and he thinks it's just in the game until suddenly he realizes this is working in real life in very minor kind of like you know he only can hover like you know a tiny inch off the ground and he's you know and, and he can only move pennies and stuff like that. Basically stuff that he can't even, he still can't convince his friend Bert that he's not just screwing around with him. <clears throat> and, but he's like, what the hell's going on? And it's like, um, within the game, uh, so like within the game, there's something where it's like, you have to find out where I am, a secret to where I am. And it's like, there's some kind of a, it's hidden. It's hidden in the, in, in the, in, in the amulet. Cause like, ah, oh, there's an amulet in the story. It's hidden in the amulet. And he goes, the amulet. Hmm. And he looks at his, he looks at this Phoebus, this Phoebus device. That's, it says Phoebus on it. It's like, can I open this? It doesn't seem to be anything opening, but then again, maybe I can do it with my head. And he kind of looks at it and says, open. And the thing opens and there's the back of the stuff, and there's a little sticker which says, uh, Hellstrom, Hellstrom, um, well, whatever the name of the store is. I haven't figured that out yet. I have to kind of, you know, it's like, that's in my town. She in my town? She, he, he goes there, meets Miss Arabesque, who seems to be this kind of eccentric woman there, who um, he notices has another, has a Phoebus. And she's like, can you read this? And it's like, oh, no, it's just squiggles, isn't it? It's like, yes, it's just squiggles. It's just squiggles. And he's like, okay, well, that's, that's interesting. And it's like, he goes back into the game and he finds like, ah, oh, Miss Arabesque is the face of the wizard. 
now it's like did i project that or is she actually in is she actually the so the one who's kidnapped the princess and he goes into the store he finds he, he miss at night but he's like he doesn't find anything it's like this is just all completely i was just imagining things um, but then he hears voices and this arabesque comes in comes in with some dudes that like those dudes were kind of snooping around at his school and things like that and they're talking and they go in they open a portal a portal in the in the air and as they go through he can see a girl in a cage at, at in in this in this strange thing there and then it shuts but it's like shit that was princess katie and he um they come back out again and he's like how did they do that and he kind of looks around and he holds up his he holds up his phoebus and it's like there's a thing there and he kind of holds it up and it clicks in clicks into the air and the portal opens it's like shit and he walks through and he's like it's princess katie but it's not princess katie it's cal a daughter of a um uh, daughter of a damn it i had this i can't remember i'll have to see what i wrote down but they break out and it's like how are they going to get back thing and it probably turns out that they need to go somewhere somewhere else maybe across town or somewhere where it's difficult to go but they have to get to and uh that'll cross them into the right dimension that they can get back to her parents and back to that thing but they are being chased by miss arabesque and these dudes and so they've got to evade them there's various evadings um perhaps bert helps them it's like you're hanging out with a girl yeah ah i just didn't think that was going to happen um and uh, we'll do that a couple of other things um, maybe some of his lo-fi stuff, maybe going through the library would be a good thing. Um, maybe that's where they, you know, some records that aren't actually online are that he can figure out where they need to go. And he can use his library skills to do that. Uh, and they, they get back to, the, get back to his, they get back to her thing. to the rescued Miss Arabesque and that taken care of. And it's like, oh, well. Do you want to stay here? Or it's like, no, I think I want to go back. It's like, I'm, I'm okay. And he kind of stands up to his parents and says, look, I, I'd like my own cell phone. I'll make sure my grades are good. If my grades are get bad, you can just take it away from me. Uh, but I need to have some connection to the thing. I know that you don't like it, mom, but this is what I'd like to do. And yeah. Probably the father actually says, yeah, okay, we'll do that. And by the way, I want a cell phone too. <laughs> and um, yeah, and uh, we'll go from there. So yeah, that's 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 sort of what I have as my Preptober outline, which is still still got some pretty wide, some pretty, pretty blank spots in it, but uh, closer. So I'm going to work and work and work the next couple of days try and get my 45 minutes in each day 45 minutes to an hour in each day uh so that i will well you know for the 30th and 31st so then I'll, on the when it comes to the first i can be hopefully getting an, a certain um, enough writing in each day and that would be really good so that is my plan um for NaNoWriMo and that's sort of my outline hopefully I will have it more nailed down I think I need to just write it down and I'm definitely thinking about making it more comedic um, making him more Jesse more hapless more neurotic uh, more having more silly things happening to him or just you know the kind of that kind of thing just to give it kind of the light tone which i would like versus kind of being mopey about it <laughs> if you know what i mean so that's my thoughts and we'll see how that goes about that that i have urges to like can i make things cheerful but sometimes that just doesn't work that way but i will see i will see all right more videos later